We will jump into this because we are uh, in a unique location because of some of the stuff that we want to share today and the first thing primarily is tall grass. So it's a special time of year for our community and one that uh, is a significant addition to our city's quality of life opportunities. Next Wednesday, October 17th, kicks off the 16th annual Tallgrass Film Festival, a stubbornly independent celebration of film featuring 190 of the best independent film films around the world. So I have the pleasure of speaking again at the opening night reception for the third year in a row. And it's one of my favorite events because it pairs a great quality of life amenity with the arts and chance to showcase our city to a wide variety of out-of-town guests and this year will certainly be the same. So next Wednesday the opening film is a light-hearted documentary about former David Letterman writer Steve Young called Bathtubs Over Broadway. Steve Young himself will be in attendance as well as the director Dave Weissenant. Friday Night Gala film will feature a documentary about musician and Wichita Rudy Love and his impact on the music industry. Following the film will be a live performance by Rudy Love and his family band at the post-screening gala party on Friday evening. Martin Starr from HBO Silicon Valley will be attending the festival Sunday to accept the Soaring Talent Award. And Pam Greer, best known for her, her portrayal of Foxy Brown in the 70s, or as Quentin Tarantino's Jackie Brown, will be in attendance to accept the 2018 Ad Astra Award. And those are just a couple of the big names who will be hanging around for the Wichita Film Festival. So you can see how proud we are of our Wichita Film Festival. Tallgrass is lucky to be under the leadership of, of Paul Melroy. Paul comes to Tallgrass Film Association with significant not-for-profit arts administration experience and particularly strong financial background as he started his career as a commercial banker. Don't hold that against him. He spent the better part of two decades with the Atlanta Opera, starting as the organization's business manager and rising to become its managing director. Most recently, he was the executive director of the Tropic Cinema in Key West, a unique art house cinema. So I will turn the podium over to Paul and let him talk about some of the new features that we can look forward to in this year's tall grass passes and such. Thanks, Mr. Mayor. I didn't embarrass you. <laughs> no, I appreciate that. Um, we are very excited uh, with, uh, to have Tallgrass kicking off next week. Um, really appreciate the, the mayor's support, the, the support of the city of Wichita, and the, uh, the support of the business community here, the arts community. Um, it's really, really a terrific thing here. Um, this is a very special festival. As you may know, it's considered to be one of the best film festivals in the country. Um, it's a wonderful opportunity to show off Wichita. We have people coming from not only all over the country, but from around the world. Um, we even have a, a filmmaker coming from Afghanistan this year. Um, it's a great chance to, to, to show off uh, Wichita and to, to do what we do really well, which is present great films. Uh, we've got, as the mayor mentioned, uh, almost 200 films this year. Uh, and we're screening films that, that derived from a, a, a about 2,000 different submissions. So we, we had to wade through a lot of films to, to get to this, but we, we think we have a great lineup this year. The mayor just mentioned some of the, the highlights. We've got some really, really interesting documentaries as well as uh, narrative type films, feature length films, short films. Um, there's a little bit of something for everybody. So we hope that uh, the, the city comes out next week to experience a little bit of tall grass. Uh, if you've never been before, it's a, it's a really cool event and uh, we'll hope you check it out. And we hope that you'll uh, help all our visitors feel welcome here. Well, like I said, we have people coming from all over the world and um, we hope you'll, you'll offer the same hospitality to them that uh, everyone's offered to me. I'm, I'm pretty new here and I've just had a great experience coming to Wichita. So. Anyway, appreciate the chance, having the chance to, to chat with everybody about this. And again, thank you, Mr. Mayor. Appreciate thank it. Thank you. Thank you very much. He's very modest. His staff told me that he is making some changes this year. And um, 
besides the, the um, pass that you can get for the duration of the film festival, they're introducing some new day passes this year. That's right. So I hope because of this new day pass, it will inspire a few additional, if it works out, we're gonna call them Paul passes. Maybe not. So thank you, Paul and the festival. So another event that we wanna to cover today and um, that we've been talking about, and it's the safe, Say Farewell to the Lawrence Dumont Stadium. And it will be held this Saturday from 2.30 to 8.30. We'll have an exhibition game, weather permitting, with some celebrities playing on both sides of the field, a showing of the film for the love of the game, food trucks, local band, the astronauts, and so much more. Also, don't want to forget that if you want to purchase a seat, you can come by earlier that day at 9 a.m. Seats start for just as little as $5. Uh, bring cash, because we're only taking cash. And um, we're asking that you maybe bring some wrenches and a screwdriver so you can be able to take the seat with you. We certainly couldn't have put this event on without great help from some outstanding sponsors, Waste Connections, Shrek Financial, or, and Farmers Insurance. And so I want to give the opportunity for those folks to come up and visit. And we'll start off with, uh, I think, Waste Connections. Is that? No? Not here today. We won't start off with them. We'll throw them aside. And we'll, so Shrek? How about Shrek first? They really didn't give me much here to work well, with. Well, that's okay. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. We appreciate it. Thank, thank you. Thank you. So on behalf of Shrek Financial Group, uh, Josh Bolin, I'm John Toothaker. We really appreciate the office uh, of the mayor reaching out to us and the opportunity that the mayor's provided for us to show our support to an institution here in Wichita. Um, Lawrence Dumont was a ripe old age of 22 when Shrek was started in 1957. And since then, uh, as Lawrence Dumont's been a, a fantastic staple, and an icon here in Wichita. We've been as big a fans as, as Lawrence Dumont as we are of the city of Wichita. And we really look forward to what's coming next uh, with the great partnership of, of city and commerce to develop the area that's down there uh, for new blood that's coming into the city all the time uh, from other great uh, community partners. So uh, we hope everybody can come out and enjoy a fantastic night of, of great entertainment and um, a great fireworks celebration. And once again, we really appreciate the opportunity to be involved. So thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. We appreciate your support. Thank you. Certainly couldn't do it without you. So we certainly appreciate that. And where's my friend, Mr. Gutierrez? He is not here today. He didn't want to. He didn't want to show up. Give him a hard time. I will. So another great partner, Farmers Insurance, and we'll let you have an opportunity to share. All right. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. Uh, my name's Asher Joseph, and on behalf of the Asher Joseph Agency, along with Jose Gutierrez and Farmers Insurance, we're honored to partner up with the city for this community event. Farmers Insurance is excited to help sponsor the fireworks show as we say farewell to Lawrence Newmont but we look forward to the future of Wichita. So again, we invite everybody to come out and join us for this amazing night, and we thank you for allowing us to be a part of it. Oh, well, thank, thank you. Thank you all very much. Mm -hmm. You wanna share? Yeah. You're good? <laughs> all right, well, we appreciate the support. Certainly, again, couldn't do it without great partners. Appreciate everything that's getting ready to kick off with uh, Tallgrass Film Festival and Paul looking forward to another great year. It's going to be an outstanding event and encourage people to get out and enjoy and as Paul said, um, meet some new people that are going to be in Wichita from all over the world. At that point, we'll open it up for questions. We are. We hope that that demolition will be able to start here pretty quickly. Uh, we'll probably take about a week after this say goodbye event to clear out some of the remaining seats and things that we're going to be able to sell. And then uh, within the next 30 days start on the demolition. So it should happen pretty quickly. And so we feel like um, we'll be able to meet the timeline by getting the stadium down and, and the ground prepared for uh, the replacement. 
Anything else? Well, again, thank you all for coming and, and appreciate uh, the support and looking forward to some really neat events coming up in our community.